All right, guys. So, um, big day today because RJ and I are heading to do something um, that we haven't done all year. Pretty much, I think the last time we did this was back in February. Um, and it's something we did frequently. It was a big part of our work. Um, and I'm excited to finally get back to doing this. Mabuhay squad. In a few minutes, we are heading to... Hey guys, welcome to my daily vlogs. Please subscribe. The recording studio, yes! Guys, it has been so long since we visited the recording studio that RJ and I have been going to for years uh, to record all of our parodies and that kind of thing. Um, we have a project, well, several projects coming up, so today we absolutely needed to go to record. And as you know, RJ and I have been warming up to like going back outside into the world slowly but very carefully to like work again, you know what I mean? Like through all of this year, we pretty much put a hard stop hibernation period on our comedy channel and even our music channel which has been in hibernation for a while but we're now open to like you know going into enclosed spaces again this will be the first time we're actually working in an enclosed space because we've been slowly easing into this new normal but most of where we've been going has been outdoors mostly except for you know like when we reserve an entire villa to ourselves no one is inside the villa it's just us but in this case we will have the sound engineer and yeah this is gonna be recording studio in the new normal I guess by the way guys if you're new to the channel welcome to the daily vlogs my name is Mikey Bustos that is RJ Garcia and uh, we're here in Manila Philippines see that be sure to hit the like button if you enjoyed this vlog and hit the subscribe button join the Mabuhay squad we will be your daily dose of positive vibes online Okay guys, here at Sumata Sound Studio, which is the recording studio that I've been coming to since 2012, since I, you know, first landed here. Um, recorded everything here. All of our major uh, parodies and music videos were all recorded here. I yeah, wear yeah. Speedos. That was recorded here. I wear Speedos. When I'm at the store, you know I'm wearing my Speedos. When I'm doing cardio, I'm wearing Speedos. This new installment. They've got like an alcohol bar here, a whiskey bar here now. How interesting, right? But yeah, I realized we actually have not been here this year at all <laughs> because the last music video parody we released was Stupid Cough Lady Gaga parody and that was recorded in another studio. So, oh, it's so good to be back to Sumata Sounds. See? See guys, welcome to Sumata. We have Soul in the sound booth. There he is. <laughs> What's up, Christian? There's Christian. He's gonna help with our second camera. All right, and today I brought my flip ear Ears because this is gonna be recorded like live while I'm singing so like don't want those big bulky headphones for this just these awesome ear monitors all right and we're done yay how was it RJ yeah I've missed the studio oh my oh OMG that felt so good to record there and we're less scared now <laughs> I'm happy 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 Sorry, Frey. Hey, we're back. We're back. Yes, did you miss us? Oh my. This was also an opportunity for Cypher <laughs> to get used to us being away again. <laughs> He's so happy. Whoa, you're all okay. Relax, relax. The leg, relax. Good morning, Mabuhay Squad. Yes, it's a beautiful morning here in Mandaluyong, Metro Manila, Philippines. Gorgeous day. How are you guys? Did you sleep well? Hmm? 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 So RJ and I are heading to a really awesome place. We're going to the farmhouse, guys. We're going to visit the construction site, see a few updates, and indeed, there are some updates. So I'm really excited about this. There's Cypher in his crate. Yes, Cypher. He is happy to travel in this crate. He loves this crate. I really love this part of the journey to the Mabuhay Squad farmhouse because this is when we like start to feel like we're out of the city now. You know what I mean? Like less buildings all around, less billboards, less traffic. 
Um, and look at how beautiful it is. Look at how picturesque it is. I think this is a lake, um, or it could be a bay. I'm not sure. RJ, what water is this? RJ says that's a fish pond. I'm sure it's like a lake, a big freshwater lake, or possibly brackish, so part salt water. By the way, guys, happy Tuesday to all of you. Tuesday morning here, we're pretty much on same day edits now. Like literally filming the stuff, the footage is edited and uploaded for you guys. It's pretty much almost as good as live streaming, but having the videos edited properly just makes the viewing experience better. I'm excited to see the house, guys. I wish we could like visit every day, but we're trying to keep it to once a week because it does take some time to get there, like about an hour. We also have to pass a toll to get there. Ooh, it's like we're crossing a state border. <laughs> Okay, we just found out it's Laguna Bay. So it is a bay. It's it's salt water. Ooh, interesting. Wow, it's so beautiful. Wait, There's a lot of birds. Lots of birds, yeah. I'm wearing my Legaya socks today. Yes. So in a way, Legaya is kind of joining us. I miss her so much, guys. The other day, I was looking and touching her feathers um, that I've collected, and miss her so much. And her pictures pop up as a screensaver on my computer, so, you know, I often remember her, but I think RJ and I have passed the grieving phase, I guess. We've kind of now started to begin accepting that she's gone, but personally, I have, like, spells where I really, really miss her, and I'm close to tears, but really, really miss her. Saif, are you excited? You excited to visit the house? Guys, you know what else? Look at my hydro flask. Yes, brought some Cypher coffee. Ooh. Guys, I love Cypher coffee. Our next step, by the way, for Cypher coffee is to choose a logo. So we're working on logos now. Um, and we're hoping to release Cypher coffee by Christmas. That's our hope. That'll be awesome, right guys? In terms of getting Cypher coffee to you abroad, that might be a challenge. However, maybe we might be able to send like individual packages for now. If you guys write to us and are willing to cover the shipping, cause I'm sure shipping is a lot from Philippines. I mean, it can't be that much. It's just a small bag like this. So I don't know, we might have to work that out. But I mean, in terms of a sustainable way and long-term way, we probably might ship a big like pallet of cypher coffee over maybe to our warehouse um Beans canada warehouse maybe in utah or possibly my parents place in canada and then ship from there uh to you guys so shipping isn't as expensive if you were to order directly from philippines so um not sure how that's gonna work but i mean we'll let you guys know <laughs> And for those of you outside of the Philippines that want Cypher coffee earlier and are okay to cover the shipping cost to your country from Philippines, then yeah, by all means, we, we will send it to you so you can enjoy it for Christmas. Oh my gosh. Mm. So guys, we're getting close, but okay. Let me know if any of you guys have this problem. So because I've been running almost 10K every day, my leg, my thighs, and my butt have doubled in size. Like literally, I, I, I feel like a female baboon in heat. My butt is so big. And because my butt is so big, my leg falls asleep so easily now when I sit down for a long time. <laughs> Do any of you guys have this problem? Those of you with, ah, Big butts. Oh my gosh, the needles, the needles, the needles. Guys, OMG, OMG. Like literally, like the right side of my lower extremities are just numb and needle-ish. Ah, big butt problems. All right guys, look, we're in the Philippine countryside. Love this. Guys, this is Cavite, the province of Cavite. It's a very beautiful, beautiful, I guess, like, place. Getting close now, guys, yes! By the way, I know a lot of you guys are watching from outside of the Philippines. Like, a lot of you are from US, Europe, and have never been to Philippines. So, I'm happy to show you, like, what it's like here through these vlogs. 
Um, for me, as a like growing up in Canada, I will always see the Philippines through a Canadian lens. So for me, the best way to describe it outside is it's basically kind of like Mexico. If any of you guys have been to Mexico, the Philippines feels like Mexico, except it's Asian. So like imagine like an Asian version of Mexico. That is kind of like what Philippines feels like. And to be honest, like when I'm in Mexico, I'm like, this is Philippines. <laughs> guys, this is, this looks exactly like Philippines. And even like some Mexicans look Filipino too. And of course, in Mexico, the Philippines, we have the uh, S Spain connection, right? Mexico and Philippines are siblings I guess in that kind of sense both tropical countries and in fact Mexico and the Philippines have been trading for centuries like there's a connection between Mexico and the Philippines okay guys we are here we have arrived to our house oh, this is gonna be so satisfying like literally being able to move RJ, do we have a lot of stuff to move? How many trips do you think it would take to move our stuff? One or two? I'm not sure. We'll rent a truck. We'll rent a truck, but like everything will be put in the truck? OMG, I am not looking forward to moving the big ant tanks. I still need to come up with a plan for that. Oh, and it's such a beautiful day, guys. I can't wait to take you everywhere. Maybe I'll even take you to the clubhouse and like show you that area. For, for those of you who are new, I'll show you guys that as well. Ooh. We got neighbors, we got neighbors. I love how partially wild it still is. You know what I mean? Like, see all of this? This is all like thick forest. So like a lot of native wildlife are for sure living in this area taking refuge, you know what I mean? All right guys, time to suit up. Oh, oh, Mabuhay squad. We are here in our future home base. Can't wait to show you all of the change, the advancements. Let's do this, guys. <laughs> 